Here's what you need to know about rain gardens from the Alberta Low Impact Development Partnership. Urban areas generate 20 times or more runoff than natural landscapes. Rain gardens help restore the natural balance by holding back and soaking in runoff from roofs, from overflowing rain barrels, and sometimes even from paved surfaces. Rain gardens offer many benefits, including biodiversity, especially habitat for our pollinators, temperature moderation, and carbon sequestration. So how do rain gardens work? Rain gardens are like a regular garden. They just have a depressed surface. When it rains, some water soaks in deeply and a lot is used by the plants. If there's too much water, it spills over and should flow where it would if you didn't have a rain garden. As a bonus, rain gardens clean up runoff through all kinds of natural processes. And they dry out within 24 hours after the rain stops, so mosquitoes don't have a chance. So that's what a rain garden is and what it does. How big should it be? Look at the area that will drain into it and divide that area by four. That's your rain garden size. Easy. Now you know the basics. Where will you build yours? We need rain gardens throughout our communities to reduce neighborhood flooding, to lessen the burden on our pipes, ditches, and culverts, to protect our streams from erosion, and to reduce flooding and pollution downstream. Every part of the landscape has a role to play in restoring the natural rainfall balance. For more resources on this and other low-impact solutions for the Northern Prairies, visit ALIDP.org.